Hello Taylors. It's been a little bit since we've brought you an update regarding the renovations project here in the Welcome Center area. And before Wally Johnson comes to do that via video, I just wanted to share my heart as to why we want to see this space updated and enlarged. It really is about making a place where the guests who have never been here before can find a place to connect and to come in and find out where they need to go. This is a big place, lots of doors here, lots of parking areas. We want to make sure that every single guest knows where to come and where to find someone to help them enjoy their time here at Taylor's. Also enlarging this space, you know what else it will do? It will make it more than just some hallways that connect us to our life group. A hallway that just takes us from your classroom to the worship center or down to the apex or downstairs to the children's area. Our welcome area is more than just hallways and connecting spaces. It should be a community space, a place where you can find resources that can help you and meet people and sit down and visit with folks. A place where if you're new here, you can learn more about Taylor's. It's a place that I think will become everything that we really are, a warm people ready to welcome more and more people here at Taylor's and more and more people into the kingdom. So I hope that's what this place can become. And so as Wiley shares with you, I hope you'll listen with your head and with your hearts and with your eyes and see what can come about here at Taylor's in this new space. Good morning. Our committee, including Stacy Burnett, Sue Florence, Andy Gibson, Rachel Howell, Bob Lee, Alan Lumpkin, Marilyn Malden, Kelly Ross, and myself want to give you a progress report on the renovation project. After contributions to the offering had been totaled at year's end, we began working together with our architect, Ron Geyer, to assemble a design team and design a space that would be warm and welcoming for guests and members alike with the funds that you so generously gave. Over the past few months, our committee has prayed for direction as we made decisions about the project design and selection of a general contractor. And after an extensive interview process, review of bids, and reference checking, we're glad to share with you that we have selected Caldwell Constructors as our general contractor. Working alongside Caldwell, our architect, Ron, and his design team, we're getting close to having a final design and pricing for the project. Once this phase is complete, we'll present the plan and cost to the Finance Committee for their approval, then to the Diaconate for review, and then to the church body for your approval. It's our tentative plan to bring that recommendation to you sometime in late May. We're very excited about seeing how the plan is coming together and we'll share more details with you soon. If you have any questions, please contact me, the senior staff, or any member of the committee. Thank you.